All right, so we're given a car comes to a stop six seconds after the driver applies the brakes. While the, bra while the brakes are on, the following velocities are recorded. So they record in, this is in seconds, uh, zero seconds at the start, two seconds, four seconds, six seconds, and then they get the velocity, which is in feet per second. And what we want to do is we want to give a lower and an upper estimate. So you could just, you know, simply pick values on the left of the table, meaning something like those, and then pick values on the right and multiply them by two, since the distance is uh, between each second is two seconds. But let's see how we could actually draw this to again, see what you're actually doing. So if I make this my second axis and this my feet per second axis, then at zero, I'm like somewhere up here at 98. So we'll put a point there. At two seconds, I'm at 45. So we'll put a point about right there. At four seconds, I'm at 22. So put a point right there. And then at six seconds, I'm at zero feet per second. So looking at this, if I just connected the dots here, okay, so what's going on is that. And now I can see if I'm doing the rectangles, if I start at the left side, so I go up to this left dot, I go over and then down to the two seconds, go to the next point, over, down to two seconds, next one, over and down, that what I'm doing is I'm finding the area of these three rectangles. And that's important instead of just memorizing your picking values from the table. So you should be able, it should be clear to see that this is going to be an upper estimate because I'm above the graph. So I'm going to take each height times each width. Well, each width is two. So 2 times 98 plus 45 plus 22. And when I do that, I get 330 feet. And now I can do the same thing with a lower estimate. So the lower estimate, I'm going to start one over. And so I'm going to go up to that point, go to the left, come down go to the next point, go to the left, go down, and then the next one, notice it's flat. And so now I'm finding the area of these three, which the last one, we're going to see the area is zero. So then a lower estimate would be 2 times 45 plus 22 plus zero, and I get 134 feet. But it's good when you're first learning these to draw them out so you can see you're just finding the area of rectangles is all you're doing.